guys, Arthur Gamers here with another video and today we are playing Space Food Truck once again, episode number 2 now. How are you guys doing today? That is still a stupid question and let's get right into it. I'm not reading this welcome message again because we've read it last time. It's actually bloody annoying it's giving it to us again, but sure. Okay, let's see where we left off last time. Uh, pretty sure we could deliver the heffalumps now. Heffalumps, actually. Sorry about that. Uh, and we have quite a few crises to deal with, and our draw pod is busted, as we've already realized last time, I'm pretty sure. Okay, so Engage will bring us back to, the, to our cabin as well. We're currently in the engineer's area, which is not a good space to be in right now. Uh, because we actually do need to be at the uh, bridge area here. So let's engage with one power card to keep two as always uh, on hand to like avoid uh, different objective uh, events actually. Sorry, like the different events that we may run into um, when we travel. Okay, good, good. Let's punch it from here. Pretty sure we would find the solar crab here, actually. Yes, we do need that really badly right now, so for the next recipe, so let's uh, put that into our inventory. Also, we could also use the vegan mushroom as well. The Ploma Pot is also a really, really good card. These are all pretty decent card, actually. Uh, decent cards. Um, probably gonna be for the whole pass now because the other ones are all quite expensive and we do still want a card that's somewhat useful. Like the six is a bit much actually for that, so let's resupply like that. The reason why I'm doing all the ingredients already, even though we don't especially need them right now, is because they only appear like seven times maximum in the zap mod, meaning if you lose too much of it, you may actually run out of the cards entirely. Well, you that's not really anything you'd want right now, uh, I'd assume. Okay, you don't need a whole pass, so you're gonna get some leftovers here. Nice, nice, nice. Not really nice at all, but sure. Okay, cook's turn. Let's see if we can cook some nice food. We do uh, need the meat pie for that. Let's check with the scarred bow first. Nothing in there, which then it shows 99. Uh, what's wrong with the drop board actually? Huh. Okay, let's do a taste test to see if we can get our post cheddar cheese in here. Uh, no, but we can get the nitro preservative in here to pay for that. Not, don't destroy cooking cards, that would be quite a stupid. Um, play to destroy one card from any player's hand and draw one. Uh, sure, I'll discard a card from anyone's hand. Let's see if you can find a Vexel here. Uh, any Vexels further? No, just you. Yep, sure. Let's uh, destroy that Vexel card. Uh, oh, can I, we actually destroyed it, not discarded it. Sure, that's even better. Um, play to pick at your next for draws. You may destroy one as well. Hmm. Probably use a taste test instead to see if we can get the poster or cheese. Uh, yes, and then destroy the Vexel, of course. Thank you that we already got it here. That means we don't have to spend any more cards on that. Um, nice. Nice, very nice. Okay, we can now cook the poster or cheese by using the preservative to power it. Then cooking the poster or cheese here. I mean, we only need the solar crab now, which is nice because we are on the planet where we can buy the solar crab. We already bought solar crab into our zap mod, meaning we can pretty much, um, yeah, no, destroy nothing. Uh, we can pretty much now uh, buy the crab, so next time we can cook it nice and evenly. What did that say? Oh, I'm too too quick with that. Crikey, um, I can't even check that anymore. That that's oh great. Um, and that turn for now. Uh, probably, oh no, the hall pass is coming now, that's good. We could actually kind of use that because we need to go to the cockpit soon. But for that, we all, oh come on, a lot of Vexel, really? For that, we also do need to uh, fix the door first to our <laughs> place here. So let's see, foresight play for our, for every one power play to this car, peek behind the locked research node in the lab. Hmm. Fast track, play this with power to unlock a rep research node, adding a new job card to someone. I'll play that one for now. Um, 
then do that. Uh, direct unlock here. Just pick that one. Secret soul. Still not the one I needed. The yellow axe will be in the engineer's row, which is kind of sad. What does the secret soul actually do? Oh, it's just the two, three ingredients, just like the other uh, deep red fructose and the nitro preservative. Meaning it's actually a generally good card, so I'm glad I got it though. Um, hall pass, because we need to go to the workshop to resolve that crisis here. Yep, pretty sure we did that right. So next we are going to move back there using um, using the foresight to see what's under some slots there so we can unlock them more easily. Uh, there, there, I do like the cooking station ones a lot so I'll do those first. Okay, nice and easy and that's it for this turn. Uh, let's see what could we use here. Mm, that's actually kind of nice a nice card we could actually really use with the scientist as well, but we don't want to give him too much to work with. Because you don't specifically need a huge amount of power here, so... You know what? Let's just give him leftovers. Probably a bad idea to give him leftovers Well, we, <laughs> we have so many cards we could have given him that were a lot better, but sure. Uh, engineer's turn. Yes, I need you. Space junk, really? Oh, really? We need to fix that? We'll lose one HP every four turns until it's fixed. Crikey! Okay, we need to do trusty wrench and repair as much as we can. Uh, first, we need to have the... Uh, space out of the space junk. Yeah, okay. Um... <laughs> We ca okay, and then uh, let's do the kitchen door so the chef can go out. I do kind of need to do the shoots as well, but I don't have enough for that right now, so that's kind of... Um... Oh, we can play the... Oh, no, we can't. Uh... No, we need power for both of those. That's kind of sad. Um... Mm, that's... kind of want to give him something that's worth something, but then we might run into issues with the vegan mushrooms. Oh, that's a dilemma. Um, yeah, I'm gonna give you leftovers, sorry. We could use something that's worth more, but... Oh, crikey. Oh, you're getting a horrible hand as well next turn. I'm glad I fixed the life support, because that would have been horrible. Uh, Corrosive Sludge. We've been blindsided by someone's irresponsible jettison sludge. Discard three powers to clean it off, or take two damage! Crikey! Dodge! Crikey, that's a lot! Whoa! Yeah, oh, oh my goodness. Um, yeah, I'm not really gonna engage right now. Let's, let's ask for some information about nearby planets we still have to go through. Fair warning, uh, that's fine. Technically, stealing is fine. Uh, French fried fuel is fine. Okay, a route to there is all fine. Let's depart as well then. We cannot hit anything that's horrible right now, so... I'm sure this is gonna be fine. Okay, punch it. Yes. There we go. Took a screenshot for the thumbnail. Yes. Okay, fair warning. Um, uh, it's gonna be now... That's not nearby at all. Space pirates. Okay. Just like the other one. Okay. Dock ship. Let's see what we can get here. Uh, spaced kale we don't actually need. Refined silk, that's expensive though. Hmm. I kind of do like the power glove as well. Hmm. Kind of like it better than the enriched in chromium, so let's discard that one. And put the power glove in. The refined silk is a bit expensive for right now because we don't have items that have a lot of worth yet for the general people in here, so it's not too much use in buying that one. Okay, next phase. Uh, we can get a hall pass, but that's not something we need. Leftovers again? Oh, crikey. I hope I can destroy some of those later on. Kind of annoying to be stuck with a bunch of leftovers, actually. Uh, okay, Cook's turn again. A Norvaxel, really? Oh, Drop Hot's busted as well. We need to repair that as well. Um, we could see if it's in a discard. No, it's not. The Vexel is in the discard. Uh, play to pick it your next for draws. You may destroy one. Maybe. Maybe not. Destroy nothing. No, thank you. Um, let's go towards the captain's area then, and then, yeah. 
Continue on. Go to the cooking, submit. No. I wish we could just go back, but we need an action card to do it as well. We might be locked up outside our station now, but that's kind of horrid. Okay, let's get the vegan mushroom. Because we need that later for the stop Zant shows. Right now we're making the vegan meat pie, and then uh, we're going to deliver some huffalums as soon as we can. Just two more power for engage cards we need for that, but you know the Captain Storm can kind of get out of hand very quickly as well. Crisis! Ominous us blinking! A red light on our dashboard begins to blink, and no one knows what it means. The scientist and captain have 12 turns to reach the bridge and cover its secrets in the ship's manual, or will surely sustain one damage. Oh, crikey. Um... Well, yes, uh... <laughs> Let's see what we can do now, actually. Uh, we have leftovers, some taste of future cards, we have a hall pass, which is... We could resolve that now, actually. That's nice. That's, uh, that's actually simpler than I thought it would be. Let's now go and do some research here. Just do all of them. Submit! And let's see what we can spend it on. We kind of want to spend it on some good cards. Don't mind if I do play the pool card from any player's hand into yours and they draw one. That could be really useful. But also really horrid because the cook already has the best cards in general. Um, the discard dive. For every two power play with this pool ingredient from any player's discard and toss it into the pot. Hmm. Not that interesting. Those. Hmm. Um, add one power to anyone's ha to add one power to card in anyone's hand permanently. Well, that actually could be really useful because we lack power on especially the engineer right now, which could actually use some more powerful cards. So let's put it on taste of the future cards, which we generally wouldn't need. Uh, don't have enough power to do that. Okay, power two of the cards up permanently, which is good, meaning the engineer will now have more power to spend with his cards to repair shit, which is kind of something we needed now. Sure, okay, next phase. Not much else we can do here. Um, you actually want to needs the next... No, you, you are... Another leftovers. Oh, crikey. I wish there was another one where I could add worth the cards, but that is logically not a thing. Okay, engineer's turn. Not anything we could use right now. Crisis! It's alive! The chef and scientist just completed an experimental souffle, which has become sentient and is hur hurling painful insults at the chef. <laughs> it's an offensive souffle! <laughs> oh crikey, that's funny. The chef and the captain have 12 turns to reach the kitchen and put a stop to it, or the discouragement is sure to cause one damage to the ship. Somehow, rather. <laughs> An offensive souffle. Oh, goodness. That, okay. Um, <laughs> no further comments, actually. No, thank you. Uh, not much we can do right now with the engineer, actually. Kind of sad. Um, in next phase, not much we can do with that. Or oh, you can actually use that quite well as well. Or use a power glove. That might actually be better because then we can draw more cards. Because versatility in the cards for the engineer is actually quite important as well. Let's do that one. Maybe the silk later one day. Maybe. Please give me some... Really? No repair cards? Okay, we did get a power glove now. That's good. So that means we might be able to get some repair cards. Because we are running out of shield now because of those damn meteors. Okay, nothing we can do with the captain. Let's just skip for those leftovers. Oh, crikey. We're going to get filled with leftovers here. That's not good at all. Okay, chef's turn. Let's see what you can do right now. It will be really nice. Oh, another Metroid. Really? We're going to be out of shield soon. Then our HP is going to go down every time we're hit, which is actually kind of bad. Um, you could surely try taste this now. Or maybe a flambe first. Play to destroy one card from any player's hand and they draw one. Which is always good. Uh, because in most cases, uh, at least one of the players who actually have a really bad card like a Vexor or Leftovers like here. There, Leftovers, you go. You go away there. Thank you. Done. Um, 
Let's use the taste test to see if we can get solar cramp, thank you. Uh, yeah, we can destroy the future card here. And then let's see if we can get another cooking card with the taste test, please. Yes, yes. And that one I'll just discard. We can use that later. Didn't read that in time, sorry. Uh, let's cook for that. Use the nitro preservative to power its cooking and use the solar crab to cook. We already got two dishes ready. We are just not moving quick enough. Come on, Captain. Come on. Okay. We actually do need the hull pass now as well. So let's give you the secondary hull pass later. Uh, let's first do the vegan mushroom, actually. They don't look poisonous. No. No, they don't. Okay, we need to find a chocolium power. <laughs> chocolium power. A chocolium powder. Which is basically chocolate powder, I presume, which we can find on only one planet. And we need to unlock the yellow X. Okay. Hmm. Interesting, interesting. Oh god, Vexels, really? Really? Crikey. Doors busted as well. Oh my goodness. Okay, uh, breakthrough. That'd be nice actually. Can we actually reduce the mutate cost as well? Here we can. Okay. Good. That's nice. Okay, research actually now. Some nice research. Could be nice. Very nice. Indeed. Okay, Captain could actually use some worth cards as well. What if we add power to the Vexel cards? That'd be kind of ironic, actually. Uh, yeah, you could actually use more worth on that. And now I need to use two for one more, so I'll put that on a Captain card. Which could surely be useful. Put it on a how pass, actually. Ah, uh, double use, but still. That's fine, it's fine. Next up, um... I probably want to give you a whole pass as well, because even though we already have a whole pass, enough whole passes actually for the scientist, because I don't want to give him any more that's worth nothing. You're already dealing with too many cards that are worth like nothing. See, we got two leftovers there. That's quite a lot actually for a single hand. Oh, crikey. Corrosive sludge. Really? On your turn? Oh, crikey. Okay, power glove, please. Give upgrades. Only upgrades, really? No repairs? We cannot. No, oh, fuck you. <sighs> uh, shields, more important. Submit shields. Oh, crikey, that's not funny. Next. Nothing we could do there. End turn, leftovers. Oh, no. Yeah, now we're getting all the trusty wrenches. Probably too late, we probably already took some damage by then. See, Metroid, another one. If we don't take damage too, we get the Engineer's Room. That's actually going to be quite a miracle, actually. Uh, use the... Uh, wait a second. We actually need to use the whole pass for something. Okay, let's get there to resolve the crisis. Resolved crisis, it's alive. And then... Go and engage towards the planet where we need to deliver the half lumps. Which would be nice by now. Which is right there, so that. There we go. Okay, let's punch it and go ahead and go away. Okay. What do we get here? Technically stealing, your engineer swipes some power from a busted old satellite. Shields refill plus two. <laughs> Thank goodness! I needed that! Punch it on! Our shields are really low. We have no shoots left at that point, so I'm quite happy with that. A crowd pleaser! Our half lumps are hit on Fugi La. Nothing but smiling faces and full bellies as far as the eye can see. It's times like these that make all the danger or near death experiences feel totally worth it. Now, on to our second stop for today. We hear the natives from Bim Bim Dim are suckers for some vegan meat pie. Let's not disappoint them. Well, that's surely not. And we also got some french fried fuel, which is really nice as well. Filling up our FTL. Pretty good, pretty good, if I do say so myself. Okay, we don't really need any of the ingredients here, so let's just add some of them. And see if we can pump up the wharf uh, for some of the people uh, we have here. 
for the coming turns. Where do we need to go now? Let's take a look at the map if we can. The uh, third is actually really close by, but the second is all the way there. How are we going to get there quickly? Oh no, oh no. Next phase, I'll go through these and then I'll likely end the episode once I've been done with the engineer this turn. Um, yeah, we... Hmm. Don't really need to spawn silk. Don't want any more leftovers, we already have the most leftovers of anyone. Okay, let's add some more to counter that. Uh, they don't look poisonous. No, they don't. No, they don't. Okay. Oh, Fright Fructose. Haven't seen that one in a while now. Okay. Bonus card! Yes, things can go right as well. I wish I could destroy that Vexel, though. Uh, we could cook some mushrooms, but we don't have the power for that, actually. Well, that's sad. Next phase. Nothing we can do. Okay, you could probably use... Um, a Diploma Ball is always nice for you, because you don't always spend stuff each turn. And you could actually then use that to resolve some shit on the ship as well at the same time. Drawbot's still busted, though. Then... Another bonus card! Oh, look, it's great! Okay, okay, okay. I understand, I understand. Okay, um... Research is all we can do right now. So let's just spend a full blam on that. Let's see if we can get the sh hmm. Can we mutate another card? Let's mutate another card. Firstly. Because you could probably use more mutated cards. Let's make that spun silk amazing at its job. Okay, nice. And then we have two points left, which we'll uh, have to pay on the scientists. We could actually get the secret souls. Mm. Maybe the other ones would be better. Secret souls is always fine. Wait, we, oh, we already got that one. Okay, um, maybe one of those ones then. Hmm. Mimi Cube is quite nice, actually. Let's pick a Mimi Cube, even though it has no worth by itself. But surely it could always be worth a thing or two. Okay, next phase. Let's bump up your worth a bit as well with. There's still a fad space scale. Lol. And. Oh no, a Vexel, really? No! Okay, you now have to go repair stuff like crazy. Okay, just a wrench. Now it's gonna be eight power at once, all at once. Okay, um. Repair the draw pod is two. It's not the most important thing ever. Uh, doors and shields are important. Let's do one, two. Okay, that's four shields at least, which is a good amount. Let's do five. Then let's repair the lab stations because we've been stuck with those for a while now. And then probably gonna do either she. Um, hmm. We could. We have to spend this one. So it's either shields, working door, or the doors that we have to repair now. Uh, let's do the lab door as well. You've been stuck in that for a while. Okay, next on, let's quickly get. Oh, we can get a spin silk. Actually, that's nice. Well then, that's gonna be it. We deliver the half lumps today, and we will be continuing our journey towards the vegan meat pie delivery at Bim Bim Dim next time. So, I hope you guys all enjoyed this video, and I will see you next time. Bye bye!